Welcome to this section of the course where we're going to talk about the concept of power. And power is one of those concepts that all of you have an idea what it means, just like uh, acceleration velocity, uh, something that you've kind of had some familiarity with before you started studying physics, but maybe you didn't really know the actual definition in terms of how physics defines the concept of power. And that's what we're going to talk about today, and we're going to work some problems dealing with that. Concept of power is really simple, okay, because you guys have had, have had some experience with like a 60 watt light bulb um, or a 50 watt light bulb being a measurement of the power um, <clears throat> in, in that light bulb. So let's talk about that. In order to talk about power, it's important to revisit what we've already talked about, which is the concept of energy. Uh, recall that we've talked about energy in, in, in a car moving and energy and throwing a ball, potential energy and kinetic energy and all that stuff. The unit of energy is joules, okay? Uh, same as the unit of work, okay? And power is, um, is, is how fast you're using your energy, okay? So to give you an example, let's say I've got some process or some, some box or something, and there's, you know, there's 50 joules of energy I've, used, I've, I've given to that box, okay? So let's say there's a box of books on the floor, and I'm going to push it along, and I'm going to give it, you know, 50 joules of energy, okay? Well, that does describe how much energy I give to the box, and I could be putting putting the box, you know, pushing it faster and giving it kinetic energy, or I could be lifting it up off the ground and giving it potential energy. But that does describe how um, how much energy I'm giving the box, but it doesn't describe how fast I'm giving it that energy. So, do I push the box across the floor and give it that 50 joules of energy in one second, like really quickly? Or do I push the box slower and does it take me an hour to give it that 50 joules? Or maybe I'm a really, you know, really slow guy and maybe it takes me a year to push that, to push those books and, and give it the 50 joules of energy. So the, the unit of energy is, it tells you the state of the system as far as how fast it's going or what its potential energy is or whatever. And the concept of power tells you how fast am I delivering that energy to the system. In other words, how many joules per second, okay? That's what I mean by how fast. So that's exactly what the concept of power is. It's how many joules per second I'm giving um, whatever it is I'm giving or I'm taking out of the system. Okay, so I'm going to write some of this stuff down. Um, recall that um, work and energy are in units of joules. Okay, and that should be nothing new to you. Okay, so the unit of power is work per unit time. 